One can always dream, right? Imagine a city in 2050. Zero greenhouse gases, at least for cooling and heating. How would it work? Almost no fossil energy resources would be needed. Coal and oil would have been replaced long ago. Even the natural gas grid would be removed in most parts of the city. The remaining grid would supply green gas to only some industry areas and some inner city quarters. District heating grids would supply energy for heating and cooling to most of the buildings in densely populated areas. Excess heat from many local companies and from combined heat and power plants would be fed into the grid. Moreover, there would be renewable sources like geothermal heat, ambient heat from rivers, ground and wastewater, and from the air or the sun. Areas with very low heat demand would no longer be connected to gas or heating grids. They would be supplied by renewable on-site resources and, as everywhere else, by the electricity grid. Also, the electricity would allow the transport of renewables from beyond the metropolitan areas into smart and energy-flexible buildings. This is not just a fantasy. In fact, integrative energy planning aims to transform today's energy infrastructure, which is based mostly on fossil fuels. The change would lead to carbon-neutral grids with considerable storage capacities and economically viable grids by reducing parallel infrastructure of gas and district heating. How did we arrive at this? Urban and energy planners forecasted the demand for energy on a disaggregated level. Raising energy efficiency constantly reduced the demand, while additional settlements increased it. Next, local energy sources were systematically screened for use in supplying the neighborhood. Adjusted planning processes, as well as reforms of legal and economic framework conditions, which is where politics come into play, made it possible for us to ensure stable long-term conditions for necessary investments. That's how we're creating a connected and smart energy future. In short, integrative energy planning will allow us to create a future without greenhouse gases and with an economically viable energy infrastructure. Don't just dream it. Find out how integrative energy planning can become reality. Amsterdam, Berlin, Paris, Stockholm, Vienna, Warsaw, Zandstad, and Zagreb did so, teaming up in an EU Horizon 2020 project. Take a look and get inspired for your own city at www.urbanlearning.eu.